Hi guys, so I'm going to show you how to do your world art on the paint boards. So you're going to need to use Fiddler, um, which is free to download. If you just Google Fiddler, um, it's the top link in the description. And you're going to need to save a picture. Now, I simply just Googled a picture of a cat and I've saved it to my area. Now, you're going to want to make sure that this picture is the same size as the Yo World whiteboard art. So, I'm just going to show you if you do right click and we'll go save image as, we'll save it in this folder. And I'm just going to call it cat and we'll overwrite it. You're going to need to open up a editor. So, I'm going to just open it up in paint um, and we're going to need to resize it. So you're going to want to select pixels and tick this. You're going to do 360, I believe it's 360, no 390 even, 390 by 2, 260 and then save that and close. Go back to your world and we'll go to Fiddler. Now you're going to want to, if you've not done this before, um, go to tools options select HTTPS and it'll probably look like this so you need to select this you need to select that one you then need to go to actions and trust root certificate you'll get a little pop-up message you need to click yes if your computer is as secure as mine you may have to select yes a few times and then just simply hit OK then you're going to want to make sure that you select enable rules and you'll be under the autoresponder tab and you're going to go ahead and select go Back in your world, you're simply just going to open up the whiteboard. It doesn't matter if it's locked or not. Select OK, then go back to Fiddler. And you should see this, which says user images backslash paint. You're going to drag it across to this white space area. Make sure that it's got a tick in it there. You're going to remove the words exact and the ellipsis. And then you're going to go here. You're going to remove all the text after the PNG. And then this one here, you're going to select find a file. You're going to go back to the picture that we've saved and you've made sure that it's the correct size. You're going to select save. You're going to go back and select go. You're going to go, you're going to open the whiteboard. You're going to click OK and ta-da, that is it. Hope you guys found this useful. Give it a thumbs up if you did and be sure to, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you, bye.